edit an existing page. Click on Pages. You will then see a list of all your published pages. Click on a page title to open it. You have the choice of a visual editor or a HTML editor. You may find it easier to use the visual editor, although please note that this only gives a rough indication of how your page may look. We strongly suggest before publishing the page, you click on the Preview Changes button first to view the page on your actual website. To add a link, simply highlight the text and click on this chain icon here. Just type in the website address. Or search for an existing page on your website. To edit a link, again click on the same icon. To remove a link, select the text and then click on this icon here. To add a heading into a page, click the Show Kitchen Sink button. You'll then see additional formatting options. Highlight your text. Then select a heading level. Usually heading 2 or 3 will work best in your design. If you're pasting in text from Microsoft Word or from an email, click on this icon here, which will remove any unnecessary formatting. You can click Preview Changes on the right-hand side to preview your page. When you're ready, click the blue Publish button on the right-hand side. To add an image, click on the Upload button. Drag a file into the box or select a file from your hard drive. We only recommend adding JPEG files, as these will be quick for your visitors to download and see. You can enter a title for the file here. Unless you want the image to be made into a link, we recommend you click None here. You can also choose the alignment of the image. For most designs, the right-hand side usually works best. For large images, we suggest selecting the Medium Resize option. Then click Insert into Post. To delete an image, click on it, then click the red icon. If you want to include multiple pictures as a gallery, upload your pictures. But don't click Insert into Post. Instead, just click Save All Changes. At the bottom, you'll see a gallery section. Choose how many columns you want. Three to five usually works best. Then click Insert Gallery.
To add a new page to your website, click on Pages on the left-hand side. Then click Add New. Enter the page title into the box at the top. If you want to change the page address, click on Edit here. Enter your page content into the large box below. If you want your page listed as a sub-page, use this drop-down menu here and select the section it should sit under. Depending on how your website has been created, a new page may or may not automatically appear in the website's navigation menu. You should consult your designer for more information. If you see any strange codes in your page, please do not touch these. Codes may have been put in by your designer to make your page display properly. You can find more information about the primary image CMS in our support area.